excitement enveloping everyone here because it is a huge occasion. The Champions League final. Who's going to be crowned Club Kings of Europe? It's Borussia Dortmund. They take on Real Madrid and it's coming up next on EA TV. And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. He's in with a chance. Couldn't quite hang on. But it just pleased out. Rudiger the starting 11 for Borussia Dortmund. Emre Can plays alongside Marcel Zabitzer in central midfield. And Niklas Fulkrug is up front. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Carvajal starts with Ferlon Mendy in the fullback positions. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Jude Bellingham has become one of the finest all-around midfield players in world football. That's no exaggeration. Well, look at Derek Charles here. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. Struggling to get it away. Brandt. Apply. Can they make something of it? Mendy. Failure to keep the ball on the part of Real. And managed to cut it out. It's a good thing too. Mendy. Taken forward by Tony Cross. He has options around him. Cross fired over. Danger averted. Dortmund unable to hang on to the ball. Vinicius Junior. Options in the centre. Superbly read and executed. It's a good Dortmund move in the making, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. No well, great vision. A matter of keeping his composure. Oh, he couldn't out with the keeper. And over comes the corner. Keep on doing what he's paid to do. Another corner. 
corner. It might still be problematic. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Really inventive stuff from Real here. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. And options at the back post here. The threat was there, but the keeper did brilliantly. And intercepts again. Aurelien Chouameni. Vinicius Jr. Terrific block. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Well, lead to the goal, the push on ahead. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. Playing it in, could still be dangerous. Zabitza, could be. Time for calm on the ball. And with that, the first half comes to an end here at Wembley Stadium. So back underway here into the second half. Can he find the right pass? time tackle good use of advantage for Dortmund Brandt Brandt oh how about that for a tackle Daniel Malen Brandt well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Vinicius Junior. Oh, this is looking promising. It's a good cross. Has to be. No real conviction in the challenge. And it might be. Oh, that's a fine save. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. And there's the delivery. Strong goalkeeping after the corner had been delivered. Pullers. And playing it through. And full marks for trying, but very deftly cut out. Valverde. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here given away by Dortmund well it could be on for him here oh in it goes the opening goal in the UEFA Champions League final well as you can see he's given far too much space but he still had some work to do and I think that's a very tidy finish it was never in doubt well back on the way here it's going to be interesting to see whether or not Dortmund can find the right reply Jaden Sancho. Ian Matson. And back to Sancho. Spot on with that tackle. Well, a no-nonsense clearance and a throw-in coming up. Substitution for Real Madrid. Well read to win possession back. to Real Madrid and he 
Vinicius Junior. The ball with Lucas Vasquez. Cross fired over. My goodness, that's a fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. And a substitution in the offing. See a short one. This could be useful. Half-hearted clearance. Well, they might be able to launch a counter-attack. It's looking promising. Real chance. And able to get a body in the way. Now sending it in. Opportunity. Get above it. A decent effort, though. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Camavinga. It's with Vinicius Junior. And a fine tackle. Modric. He doesn't have to do it on his own. Vinicius! And oh, an excellent save, and they're still alive. Well, that really would have been it. They're still in it here, but they're going to have to be quick. He's driven in the corner. Punch clear. Making progress. And fine reading of the situation. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. A deep delivery. Making sure nothing came of it. And a Yemi. They have to be bold, Borussia Dortmund, in these circumstances. Wonderful chance. Again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing that people can do about that. Well, I think it's fair to say, Ancelotti can't believe his team have let the lead slip here. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. And just five minutes remaining. Valverde. And now Rodrigo. And level it is in the closing moments. And Real Madrid changed that. Pulls it back. A good and fair challenge. lost by Real Madrid Rodrigo the ball with Lucas Vasquez and Bellingham and there it breaks down but credit to the defence that is that after 90 minutes they are level, and extra time is coming up. Well, back on the way here, and it's quite simple. Both teams must steal themselves for 30 extra minutes. Zabitza. This was so much power. Just look at the follow through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. Well, the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Eder Miri 
Militao. Vinicius Junior. Now with Bellingham. Oh, lovely work to get past his man. Valverde. On to Modric. And the attack carried an initial threat but fizzled out. Karim Adeyemi. Here's Valverde. And Modric carries it forward. Let's see what he does next. Modric! Well, the shot looked promising, but the keeper had the measure of it. Pullers. possession one minute of stoppage time has been added on oh that's a super piece of defending first period of extra time completed 15 minutes left and then it's a penalty shooter and so 15 more minutes we're into the second period of extra time here. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Daniel Malin. Now Dortmund being afforded too much room. Opportunity. He's blocked it. But when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Good pass. Brandt. Malen. And he's got to clear his line. And the attack fizzling out. Marcel Zabica. Well, conceding the throw in. Good challenge. But Sancho now. And return to Sancho. Teammates in the middle. What a commitment to defending. One minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. How about this? Borussia Dortmund have only gone and won the UEFA Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserve it on the night. For these players, the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond well they have to make the most of this don't they it's a great thing what an achievement for them well they don't need to be reminded about what comes next it's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy well there's some tired players out there but what you can be sure of they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Borussia Dortmund. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much.